Nam 2019, Eddie V here with KUCR Radio at the Remo, infamous Remo with Chalo Eduardo. What's up, man? Man, everything is good, man. Welcome to the Remo booth 2019. Here we are. We got some great stuff. You're going to love it. And let's start off with what we call is the Lock Top Drum Riser. This is the Lock Top Drum Riser. What it does is it raises the drum off the ground. A lot of people may have be challenged when they're playing a drum to put it between their knees and hold it up so that you can get a tone. This actually helps if you just put it on the drum uh, and it raises it up so you can get all the full tones on it. It's easy to, it's easy to uh, assemble. Basically, you just lift this up, twist it, and you can take it with you any place. It's pretty, pretty cool. To open it up, you just lift it, twist it again, and just open the legs, and voila, there you go. The lock top drum riser, and I'll just demo it on one of these drums, and you'll see what I mean. Yeah, let's, let's get a little demonstration with these drum risers. There you go. It has different steps. Each one of these steps represents the base of any one of Remo's many uh, drums. So not only can it accommodate this model, which is the festival drum, but it can accommodate all the other brand drums that we make. Well, let's hear a little bit of it. This is on a drum riser. Love it. You can hear the low, the bass, the tones, the whole thing. Everything's on there. Lock top drum riser. Is this brand new? Is this brand new? You guys are premiering it? This year. Brand new for this year. It's available now. Absolutely available. Just go online. You can check out some of the videos, remo.com, and check out the experience of drumming. What I love about this particular is for those percussionists that also want to use their feet on a kick drum or on other instruments now, they don't have to be gripping the drum. And like, cause I, I actually do that. So I'm like seeing it like, well, there's some potential here. It's a happy day today. You got your wish. Is there aftermarket thoughts about this fitting just other drums that are out there? Well, the aftermarket, at this point right now, it's, it's mainly focused on the Remo drum brand. Uh, I'm sure someone will discover that it also could fit somebody else's. But at this point, it's all for the, the Remo drum brand. How much does one of these retail? Uh, it's going to retail for about uh, $49 MSRP. So you probably get something like, you know, around $30, $29. Pretty good brand. Right on. What else is new with you guys? Is uh, let's, let's go. We're taking a little walk here at the Remo booth. Nam 2019, and we're feeling alive. Let me do that. Okay, uh, to understand a little bit about what Remo does, not only are we famous for the drum heads, for drum sets, but we make the world percussion. We make world percussion for different populations, meaning that in some populations, you, you let's say you're in a school, and you have a math class next door, and it's a little too loud. Drums are not always soft. We like We make our drums so they project. But sometimes in a certain population, you need them to be a little softer. So we've developed a whole line of products that actually reduces the volume of the drum and still reach the, the quality that you want. So for example, if you're in a setting where you want to use our famous ocean drum, this is one of our branded products, the ocean drum, that sounds like the ocean. This is a standard one. Let me just play it here. So that drum in a loud room like this sounds pretty good. But let's say you're in a dance studio or a yoga studio or someplace where you really can't use that volume. We created this drum called the Night Waves Ocean Drum. So imagine yourself in Hawaii or someplace along where the ocean is. And you're a little bit far away from the ocean and it sounds like the waves in the distance. That's what Night Waves so basically it has two-sided head. This is what we call a skin deep head. I'll play that side first. Now I'll play the very night time. So 
So for, for a setting for when, like you said, you're in a studio and everybody's trying to meditate, it's a little bit of a subtler sound. A much subtler sound. In this room where you have a lot of ambient sound, that mic might not be able to pick it up. But when you're in an area that's quite quiet, you're going to hear it. So that's uh, the night waves ocean. Fortunately, the drum section at the NAM is not quiet by any means. So. No, it's not conducive hardly for talking. But you can hear me because we have a mic. Hey, right on, Remo, doing things for the wellness, because that's what drums do, yo, they're vibrations and they, they heal. So thank you, Chalo. Oh, you got, we got more, we got more. Oh, praise. Remo makes a lot of products and our tambourine is one of our largest selling products. Everybody in the world uses a tambourine. These are our praise tambourines. We've added a few more finishes where you can play the tambourine like this. You could play a gospel style. You could play Brazilian. And it looks good, and you have a great graphic. So we have four new graphics here, and this is the Praise Tambourine. It definitely seems like it's uh, being marketed towards, at least these towards uh, some of the religious folks. Yeah, anybody who wants to praise and worship you know, and, and whatever that means for you. And even if you don't, it's a great sounding instrument uh, that you could use it for any any use. This one here uh, is the wild tambourine. Notice the animal skin there. Wild. It's wild. Tambourine. It's got a nice sound. It feels almost like a, it feels like it's like a real skin. Yes. So Remo, what we do is we emulate the animal skin, but we make everything synthetically. That's an impressive thing to me, because there's something to the actual highs, and I have played some Remo drums, and I'm like, oh, that djembe sounds very good. What goes into really crafting that? What What can you tell us about that secret? Well, I can't tell you because it is a secret, but I can tell you this that the effort that is put in to make a synthetic drum head for world percussion, there's a lot of science that goes behind it. Because you have to, first of all, understand what the drum sounds like with an animal skin. And we know that an animal skin sounds great. So we take that sound and we, we, we analyze it. We play it. We know what it feels like, uh, how it tunes. All of those are very important when we come in to make the recipe of what a synthetic drum head would be to emulate that. So whether it's the texture or whether it's the bass, the high pitch sounds, the tunability of it. The benefit of having a Remo synthetic war percussion head is that it's really not affected by the weather. Animal skin gets affected by the weather. It dries out. If it's cold, it detunes. If it's hot, it tunes up high. So it's very hard to control. Although if you have a controlled environment, it could sound very good. Like let's say if your home is always at 69 degrees, it would sound great. But uh, so more and more uh, drummers and non-drummers are using uh, the Revo products. I mean, with the synthetic head, it makes sense if you're touring and you're going through different climates where the, well, like you said, it gets affected. It's a very effective tool. Yeah, not only is it good for that population, but also let's say you're in the health and wellness, you're in a medical facility. Uh, you can disinfect the drum head where an animal skin, as soon as you start putting moisture on it, it gets affected. And there's a lot of porous properties that it's hard to disinfect, you really gotta rub it. Anyway, there's a lot of benefits aside from sound, aside from using it in tours that the Remo product uh, 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 accommodates. Um, I mean, it, ma it makes sense to me. You want you want the high to react to, you, to your hands and you can't be putting product on it. It'll affect it with the synthetic head. Also, to an extent, no animal has to be a part of that experience anymore. Yeah, we've sa saved a lot of uh, cow and, and water buffalo and uh, lambs, snakes. A lot, of, a lot to the tradition that is definitely respects the animal when they put this, the hide on the instrument, but we're moving into 2019 now so it's, and beyond, so it's a different approach. We try to accommodate for all populations, yes. Talking to the vegans, we good. All right, so, well, we pretty much are ending the tour here. We got one more thing we're going to show you, and that is that Remo Incorporated is the largest manufacturer of drum heads for OEM. 
What does that mean? Original equipment manufacturers. That means Yamaha, Pearl Drums, LP, Minel, every manufacturer of a drum generally uses a Remo head when it's a synthetic head. So you'll, you'll notice that quite a bit. Uh, the crown is healthy, wealthy, and gives a very positive product for the populations that we serve. So come on over here, we're gonna check out this. Masi Mas, let's see who they're making them for. Okay. New products are uh, Bongo drum heads, the R-Series model fits. Uh, it, it fits the Minel, Toka, LP, Gombop, and a number of other brands. That's really a big challenge when you're designing the diameter shape to accommodate all these different drum brand manufacturers. The quality is still the same. Uh, it's just the, the uh, where it fits and how it fits. Now we say find your fit and go to remo.com bongo guide. Because sometimes it is a mystery because when you have traditional instruments like this, they're not all standard sizes. So we've uh, accommodate that for, for that population. Uh, but specifically for these four brands or have you had some off-brand bongo? Uh, sometimes the off-brand bongos, people discover the di uh, on our website, you can get the diameters and you can sort of say measure your drum and that helps out a lot. So a lot of people have discovered a lot of other non-brands, uh, off-brands that actually uh, have a compatibility with our drum heads. And they sound great. They do sound great. Seguimos. We're going over to the congas now. The same thing. Uh, this model, it's called a Symmetry Conga drum head. It fits more models in the manufacturing industry. So, like I said, basically the same thing. LP, Pearl, uh, Mino, Toka. Uh, the, the, the synthetic film, the science of it, is creating a film that really sounds like an animal skin without the... Uh, the the weather properties that an animal skin uh, offers. And also, uh, we have a graphic ability where we can have something uh, a different color. That right there is a calf skin, and it literally is an image of a calf. This is our fiber skin right here, and this is our new skin. All have great sounds, all have different feel to it. Uh, their playability is a little bit different. And guys, whether they're playing with Santana, or whether they're on tour with anybody else, they usually use their selection, whether it's one of these particular uh, uh, models of film. I'll just play real quick. That's it for the tour on the World Percussion side. Thank you so much. My name is Chalo Eduardo, and enjoy the rest of your time here at NAM 2019. Peace out, everybody. Thank you, Chalo. Uh,